Japan! I'm home, everyone. Oh, welcome back. You hungry? I can whip you up something real quick. She only just got back, and you already want to give her a tummy ache. Jeez, you didn't have to go that low. She attracts people to her, and puts smiles on their faces as natural as breathing. She's just like her father. Is it me, or is Anne acting weird? She's probably still upset about her necklace being stolen on the inside. Mm, makes sense. Oh. Your comrades are living it up. You're not joining them, man? I don't really feel I'd fit in. Because you're half beamed? Yeah. Do you intend to keep that from them forever? No, I'll tell them. Someday. Why not get it over with now? Sometimes you gotta wait for the right time, Prince. The longer you keep it inside, the more it'll eat away at you. If you're going to tell them, better sooner than later. Just my personal opinion. Maybe you have a point. Thanks for the advice. I'll do it. I'll tell them. Everyone, listen up. Um, so the truth is, there's something I have to share with all of you. Why so stiff all of a sudden? You can tell us anything. Right. Well, I'm... I'm not actually fully human. As it turns out, I'm... I'm half-fiend. Huh? Is this some kind of joke? I'm being serious! I had no idea either until recently. But... My mother was a fiend. L Longo, is what Anne just told us true? <clears throat> it's true. I can't believe it. What the hell? Queen Lilith was a fiend all along? I thought Bread was the one who was lying to us. Turns out the only liar was you, Longo! Longo, please explain yourself. This is a serious matter. It could threaten the very existence of the Resistance. <clears throat> I apologize. It wasn't my place to share a secret King Jam and Queen Lilith wanted kept so badly that they hid the truth from even their own daughter. So does that mean that the king really was being mind-controlled by a fiend? The only truth in what Bred said is that Lilith was, in fact, a fiend. King Jam was not being mind-controlled, nor manipulated in any fashion. The two of them were truly, deeply in love. Uh, fine. But hiding all of this from us was still awfully convenient for your cause, wasn't it? <clears throat> that I cannot deny. What the heck? I can't tell what's real and what's a lie anymore. Same. I honestly don't know who or what to believe at this point. That's easy. The only person you can fully believe in is yourself. Are you telling me now you think Anne's your enemy just because she's half-fiend? Well, I think I need some time to go clear my head. Good idea. 
Maybe we should revisit this tomorrow morning. Guys? Anne, I'm so sorry for causing you such distress. Oh, I'll survive. It was just a bit of a shock. Now I've kind of warmed up to the idea of being part fiend. Finding out I've got an uncle was a plus too. Well, don't call me uncle! Ah, of course. Beelzebub is Lady Lilith's brother, so... Aren't you bothered by your allies turning their backs on you? As Udo said, they just need time to think. Do you wish to rest? We have prepared rooms for you. Allow me to show you around. I would like to hear what you've all decided. I'm... I'm going to keep fighting for the Resistance. Are you sure? I'm a scout. It's my job to go see the truth for myself with my own eyes. And everything I've seen of you two tells me you're trustworthy. I'm staying too. Not so long ago, I'd have left after hearing this. But now I know that some demons can actually be trusted. I vote we keep on resisting too. You guys are too soft. But I guess if Anne herself ain't mad about having this kept from her, I shouldn't be either. Oh, fine. I'll be the bigger man. How about you, Bien? What are you talking about? I can't even imagine leaving Princess Anne's side. <laughs> Thank you, Bien. And everyone. So, what's the plan? We're saving my father, of course. We'd love to. The thing is, we don't know where he's being held. That's true. We're just as stumped on our other objective of reclaiming the Aquanium. We can help with that. We saw the rough location of the capsules with the radar at Endmill Base. Wow! You actually know where it all is? Porto, bring the map, please. Right. Besides the Aquanium from Zeyu's ship and the one we saw being transported at high speed... There's still one left that Brad hasn't gotten his hands on yet. Rionda Battleship. A sunken ship known for giving even famous Junkers trouble. That's no reason not to go. Indeed. We leave, as soon as everyone's ready. Well, we're traveling light, so we might as well go on ahead. Thank you for coming. Whoa! 
Fate keeps on bringing us together. What did I do in a past life to deserve that? Why are you here? Do I even need to ask? Yeah, doubt it. Ah, oh, come on. Do we really have to do this? I'm not in the mood to throw fists with you chumps. Good. Then take your men and leave. See, that won't work either. I got a job to do. You just can't make some people happy. So what? We gonna fight or no? Hmm. I got a suggestion for you. How about whoever reaches the engine room first gets the Aquanium? So, you want a race? Doesn't breaking a sweat sound better than spilling blood? I suppose this is the best we could hope for. Sounds like we've got a deal. Wait for the signal. On your marks, get set, go. Okay? On your marks. Huh? Get set. Huh? Hmm? What? Go! What the? I can't see a thing! Dang it! My eyes still sting! I'm gonna find him and see how he likes being made to cry! What the heck is he thinking? Maybe this is his own odd way of showing gratitude for how you two saved him. Then maybe he should stop competing with us and just give up. Well, in all fairness, <gasps> he does have a reputation to uphold. General Croa might join us? Hmm. I think that might be taking it a bit too far. That's a pity. So there are ruins in Forest Land too, are there? Then we've got to go check them out! Sure, but be careful. Dangerous creatures have a habit of making their homes there. engine room above. Gotta go up. Then let's find a path that'll take us that way. Here we go. I think we can get up from here. Let's hurry! 
We must get the Aquanium before the Forestland army does. Just like the container we saw at the entrance. The problem is that whatever's powering it is out of energy. What's this? A battery? The door might open if we pop it in. Yeah, it's open! Of course the guard bots show up now. Let's smash them and keep moving! <laughs> 